We're back on the 4 and 1 Let's Play, and we gotta get to work on the Dragon Festival on all four of these accounts. We're playing on my 11, 12, 13, and 14 today. We have a huge day, guys. We are going to be maxing out the Town Hall 11. We're also gonna try to make some progress on the Dragon Festival events, but we're not really gonna focus on that. We're really just gonna try to focus on what we've been doing. Grinding up, trying to get some of the builders going, and grabbing some of those star bonuses. We actually have enough to get these last two cannons already upgrading here on the Town Hall 11. Now, the Town Hall 11 is probably not going to be seen much on the 4-in-1 Let's Play. It's going to become the 3-in-1 Let's Play because, well, we just finished our Town Hall 11. But like I mentioned in the open, we do have the Dragon Festival. So I do want to do at least one attack here. We'll also get that star bonus and just get a little bit of progress on the Dragon Festival on this account because I am going to have to grind it out eventually. We still got plenty of time on that though so loot doesn't really matter for us on this let's play so let's just go ahead and let's go in here and let's uh just get a three star that's that's the plan anyways let's go ahead and zap right there let's do the same over here zap those out okay nice and then we can really just uh zap some damage and get that bow out yeah that'll work out and then we could just kind of run everything in up the middle here oh uh, yeah let's do that let's go ahead and let's send in right here for the eagle artillery and then we can just kind of work everything up the middle here. I guess we could have went off to one of the sides. So that might have been better. So we could have got one of those single compartments open. Ah, that's all right. Too late now. We're already committed. I think we'll still be fine on this, even though that single is going to be a little bit of a problem for us. Like as far as like eating up our troops and just being annoying. I think it shouldn't be too big of an issue. Or maybe it will. I guess we'll find out soon. But we're going to hop over right over to the Town Hall 12 next. Because like I said, we... Uh, we're pretty much done with this account now it's it's kind of crazy the the 11 is already done but i mean that's kind of to be expected let's just hit warden ability here just to protect these witches for a split sec uh warden where are you going uh i don't like the warden being in there warden warden get out of there i'm gonna rage these up just oh just kidding he didn't get out of there he didn't get out of there in time we do need a three star though so we need the witches to kind of work through here and get one of these singles down or both of these singles down we gotta get to these singles eventually oh boy oh boy we took we picked the wrong base i mean i just saw singles and i was like oh that'll, that'll be easy but we don't bring any wall breakers with this i think it'll still be fine i think it'll still be fine we got tons of witches all the splashes obviously down now uh we'll have the queen and king to work through here maybe we could even put this over here yeah see now the witches will start work or not the witches the skeletons I guess and the witches. We'll start working on the walls, which will be really nice. King would go ahead and break through there. All right, we got some skellies breaking through over here. Nice, skellies getting through there. Yeah, see, we'll eventually get there. It's just, just a little bit of a process. I was going to say, if the window's inside there, I would have been very angry. Look at all these skellies we're going to have, though. There's going to be, <laughs> there's going to be like 4 million and 12 skeletons coming over here. Go, skellies, go! Nice. All right, so that's all we need to do we'll get a star bonus we'll get a little bit of progress on the dragon festival but the town hall 11 is officially max let's go check out the 12. the town hall 12 is kind of in the same spot we left it we have a lot of hero upgrades to go but honestly i just haven't farmed enough on this account but we should be able to get our grand warden upgrading here today we also do have our lab open but there's not a lot in our lab it's just all of this stuff which really at town hall 12 doesn't matter a ton uh, instead, we can go ahead and we can get another siege machine upgrading like our battle blimp, but we do need to go out and do some live attacks so we can get our star bonuses. I am going to go ahead and upgrade this wizard tower here because that's the last level on that wizard tower and that'll finish that wizard tower off. So that'll be good. And now we can go out, we can farm up a little bit and maybe we can get one of these other heroes up also with the warden. He needs just a little bit, but maybe we can get like queen or king at 130,000. We'll see. We'll see how we do. And since we need Dark Elixir, this base will be perfect. I mean, we need other loot as well. So this this will just work out really nicely for us. So let's go ahead and let's just run everything in. Let's just get a little baby funnel going here. Uh, we don't need a crazy funnel with this attack. We just need enough to get the heroes to go inside the base. And it looks like we should have that. With the five ICG, we're just going at as much of the splash as possible since there are single target infernos we don't have to really worry about those maybe if those were multis we would went with a side approach but since those are singles we're gonna go straight on here go ahead and hit warden ability before the giant bomb goes off so that we can go ahead and just protect our log launcher so we can get a little bit further into this base here go ahead and let's rage right here at the town hall where's our king okay he's walking around 
He's going to get burned up by that single, but I'm not really worried about that. As long as we get the Town Hall down and get as much of these Wizard Towers down, which really, there's not much Wizard Towers left, we should be pretty fine here. I think we can go ahead and fly the bats in from this top side here. Queen goes ahead and works through there. That's nice. Nothing came out of the Clan Castle. But really, we just have to worry about this Wizard Tower, the two Wizard Towers, rather, down here. I'm going to go ahead and poison that Queen just because, well, we can. That sounds like a good idea to me. All right, so let's go ahead and let's freeze the Wizard Tower and Expo combo here. All right, nice. Working through there. And then we got one more combo over here to freeze up. We can also get the King in there, which is going to be really, really nice. Let's freeze it one more time. Yeah, this is this is nice and easy, guys. I love 5 ICG. Definitely, honestly, I think I just like watching a good bat wave. I think that's more of what I like. Uh, 5 ICG is good, don't get me wrong. But a good bat wave, man, it just does it for me. Like... Seeing the bats swarm through a base, clear out those defenses, and then even clean up a base, it's just so, so satisfying. So that'll actually give us our first star bonus because we had two worked over. So uh, because I had that just planned out, don't worry about that. We're good. Now we just need to get a little bit more here. But we do need a lot of Dark Next Elixir. Maybe we can snipe some out. Check this out, guys. Another one with similar loot on it. Uh, we do want to get to the Eagle, but I think if we go into this multi, we should be able to get to the Eagle by proxy. Uh, so let's go for it. Let's uh, let's just work in here. Let's send this over here with like this. All right, and then we're just gonna send in the ice golems here momentarily, as we kind of just get working through here. Let's send them all in. Send in some bowlers. All right, good. Send in all the heroes. Perfect, guys. Perfect. Now we'll be able to work in, open this base up a little bit. Ooh, just realized our spells get a little bit jacked up here. That should be okay. I'm gonna go ahead and hit early warden ability here just because he's starting to wander on us yeah he's going outside but also it'll protect everything as we push in towards the town hall and towards that eagle artillery who i really want to protect our king here okay wait uh the ice golem freeze that i popped the king ability to try to protect him but I, I wanted to protect him from that single the other singles locked onto him now but i think we'll be fine yeah oh yeah his splash damage from the giant gauntlet gets us through there we got eight bat spells so let's run all eight of the bat spells over here uh spells get jacked up that happens sometimes i think it might have been like maybe the poison in there might have messed with things Ooh, we missed the expo that's okay though we just got one more wizard tower try to be frugal on these freezes because we only have a few left uh but look at this bat wave guys talk about a satisfying bat wave that is a bat wave all right nice we'll get through there we'll get that all cleaned up throw in our cleanup troops uh and yeah that's that's crushed that's good another like 12k on the dark elixir if we keep finding those We'll definitely be able to get a hero upgrade, but we need one more to finish off our star bonuses on this account. All right, guys, stick with me on this one. We're not gonna do anything crazy. We're just gonna, we're just gonna send our battle blimp, or not our, even our battle blimp, our log launcher right in here. Uh, we'll, we'll hit the warden ability. Uh, just because we can get this town hall, I think for essentially free. I, I think that's the plan. If we can get this town hall for free. That means we don't lose any trophies. Good, positive, winning. Uh, but also, we can we can get a star towards our star bonus, which, actually, did we only need one star? Well, we can get all that, that dark elixir, and we can get all that loot essentially free on this base. Uh, so we'll, we'll do that. We'll let this work through here, and I think we might have to do another full attack, though. I think we still need quite a bit of loot. Let's, uh, I'm just going to let these work. Let me go find another one. All right, another 11K. Oh, this should be pretty nice and easy. I mean, it's a dead base, so, uh, yeah. This, this is just going to be a gimme pretty much here, guys. We'll work through, though, because we, we need the loot. We, need, we really need to get these heroes upgrading. Even if we don't get them both up today... Oops, I did not mean to hit the warden ability. I was trying to scroll. Uh, if we don't get the king and queen up, if we can get just a king up at minimum, I think that'll be good. I think that'll be good. So our goal is to get king and warden going up, which we have the elixir for the warden. We just need to get 130,000 on the dark elixir, to get our king going up. So that's our new goal for the Town Hall 12 for today. And honestly, I think we should have no problem hitting that. Go ahead and let's just run our bats in here. We're in a hurry, so let's go through here. We're not really in a hurry, but uh, all the splash is down, so we can really just swag out all these spells. Yeah, we, get, we, we, we don't need those spells. We don't, we don't need no stinking spells. <laughs> all right, let's run in our cleanup. I guess, I guess we're going speed run on this one. We're going speed run on this one. Let's pop queen ability since we're in speed run mode. All right, there we go. That's good. So we get that. We probably need one more of those because we do have like the five or six K 
from our star bonuses but let me see if we can find something like that all right i think this will do it 12k on the dark elixir let's go ahead and let's work in actually let's run our pekka in here run in a couple witches and stuff over through here and i think we're gonna go ahead and throw in our siege right in here nice and early just kind of go through there use that pekka to tank for us should be pretty good pekka will go ahead and take up the enemy queen nice our funnel's establishing just want the king and queen to work up the middle nice solid Let's see if the log launcher will take out this single it does perfect nice guys so far so good let's go ahead and let's hit king ability and pair that with warden ability as we make our entrance into the core all right so we got a couple of wizard towers over here we got one over here so always keep in track of where those wizard towers are the queen kind of just went to an awkward spot why now she's gonna break a wall oh queen i feel like we can get through this though uh, even with this being this awkward. Uh, let's go for it. Let's go for it here. Uh, let's go like this here. Okay, let's send in our bats. Yeah, because Queen's going to get those other wizard towers, so that'll be good. All right, so we'll get that wizard tower out, and then really, we're good from here. We just throw in the rest of our spells. That way our spells don't get jacked up like they did before. Throw in this, throw in this, throw in that. That should, I think, if my math is right, that should get us where we need to be. Yeah, yeah, that'll get us 130,000. So we can get those couple upgrades done. Oh, I wanted to drop that poison down. That's okay, that's okay. Uh, 450 red envelopes also. Now let's come back here. Let's go ahead and let's upgrade our Barbarian King. Oh, wait, we gotta grab our, yeah, there we go. We gotta grab that out of there. Now let's go ahead and let's upgrade our Barbarian King to level 57. Let's upgrade our Archer, our Archer, our Grand Warden to level 37 as well. And then with the gold, we still have like these little Teslas and stuff. I think I, I still want to kind of get these all caught up here. So let's just keep working on the giant bomb and the Tesla there. Now, Town Hall 13's turn. So on the Town Hall 13, things are progressing pretty decently. We do have our laboratory open, and since CWO ended, I didn't even think to check this on the other accounts, but we do have some hammers. So I'm gonna actually just use a hammer to upgrade the skeleton spell because we need a ton of dark elixir on this account. So we can get a hammer of spells, and probably not the best use of it to be honest, but I really wanted to get the Apprentice Warden up anyways, so we'll use a hammer of fighting on that as well, and then we have a hammer of heroes just on standby. Now I definitely want to get a hero going up here today, and it looks like we have enough for the Royal Champion, and honestly, that's probably where we need to go. I doubt we get to the Archer Queen, but if we do, we'll upgrade the Archer Queen. We do have six builders over here, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to start off with this Wizard Tower. We don't really have anything cheap over here. This is all very expensive stuff. Even these cannons here are 5.8 million each. So let's just go out. Let's get some farming done. We can drop all of our elixir into walls. We have no use for elixir on this account. It's all a gold and dark elixir right now. So let's uh, even use a wall ring right there. And if we have enough, yeah, use a wall ring right there. So we'll go out and we'll use our Yeti Super Wiz bats. All right, we're not going full out on this one. We're just gonna grab all of this loot in here. Yeah, that seems like a great idea. Uh, let's just let our king just kind of work through here with his ability. Grab, really, we just need a lot of the dark elixir, but I guess we'll need some gold and regular elixir also. Uh, so we'll just kind of let everything work through here. Did I really fumble this that hard? Uh, yeah, King's going to go the wrong way. Hmm. Uh, I mean, what do we have in here? We have that. Uh, we, could, we could just do We could just put that stuff in. Uh, we, we fumbled that hard. So what we'll do is we'll just run this in here, and then we'll just rage it up to get through this town hall since I completely messed that one up, guys. Eh, that, that happens. That happens. Uh, so we'll let Queen work through here. King's going to actually end up getting taken out. But a nice little progress base with a little supercell design. I, I like that. Uh, so we definitely need that loot. Uh, actually, we don't really need the elixir. So I'm going to go ahead and pop out of here. We'll take that gold and dark elixir for sure. Now, this one's a little bit risky, but I feel like it should be okay since everything's pretty much dead on the base. So let's go ahead and let's work through here. Let's work through there. Let's wall break. Ugh, where's wall breaker? Let's wall break. We'll just, we'll just open both the walls. Fine. We got, we got enough wall breakers. And send all this stuff in, send that all in. Oh, okay, great, fantastic. Uh, with the scatters and the multis being down, that's why I'm not really worried about this one. Uh, if the scatters and multis were up, I might have second thoughts about it, but honestly, like, our town all 13 is pretty, pretty decent. I mean, it's it's a solid 13, it's not like we're like rushed or anything like that. I mean, even though like we're we're at a bottleneck, oh, we got I think that's the battle builder one. Uh, even though we got a little bit of a bottleneck right now, it's just like the last few levels on our king and queen and stuff. So like we're, we're living life all right here. 
Um, I should probably have raged up with the Town Hall, though, huh? Yeah, that's fine. But we can pop Queen Ability here. We have... We have RC and we have that still, so I, I feel pretty good about what we're doing here. Uh, let's go and throw all that in. Okay, nice, good, positive. Good stuff right there. We'll let uh, RC throw her Seeking Shield. Again, Eagle's down, so we don't have to worry about that. We'll get through the remainder of the splash over here, it looks like. So that should be pretty good. Uh, let's see if we can just freeze on this stuff. Okay, good. Working? Cooking? Nice. Nice, we're going. Me and my bats, boys! Me and my bats! All right, there we go. Nice. Get through there. Let's dump off the rest of the army! Okay, there we go. We get through there. Actually, that wasn't as close as it, I thought it was. Uh, but we do get all that, and that was a nice, really solid raid. But we need quite a bit more of those, but that will give us another star bonus here. Or I guess a star bonus. I was playing a little bit earlier in preparation for this video. Uh, but we need quite a bit, and I wouldn't mind uh, like finishing off this, and maybe even like a couple of these, so we can get... Like the builder boost and stuff so i guess we could have did that earlier huh we should have probably waited on that yeah i didn't think that out too well did i but we'll get those and then we'll uh we'll go with the rest all right guys another huge one let's go for it here let's go ahead and send in our yetis and our wizards to funnel uh, let's keep that oh that's only a level three rc i'm not overly worried about that our royal champion's higher level than that <laughs> all right let's work through there <laughs> Uh, I don't know what I'm doing sometimes. Let's go ahead and let's send all this in. Let's uh, ooh, let's let's do get that on the king. The king's a little bit higher level, but our heroes are pretty decent for this base. Uh, again, infernos are down here, so we should be good. Bows are down, eagles down. I mean, that's why we're finding all this loot, right? That's that's realistically why we're finding all this loot is because uh, the base is a dead base, so that's fine. Let's go ahead and let's uh, run through here with the rage. I'm gonna hit Warden Ability just to protect these Yetis as they make their way to the Town Hall. They're probably ranged a little bit closer to the Town Hall. That's okay, but not the end of the world. Uh, let's run her over here into the Tesla Farm. And then King will work through that last Wizard Tower. We really... Ooh, 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 scatter shot right there. Didn't see the scatter shot almost there, guys. Uh, it could have been lethal to the bats. Let's keep that frozen. That way it doesn't be lethal to the bats, so to speak. And we'll be fine. There we go. That's all good. Fine and dandy. Nice. Uh, that bomb tower is up there. That's fine. Let's throw these in over here. Okay, good. Fantastic. Throw in the poison just so we don't have the overlap. Throw the seeking shield. Nice. Nice. Throw the queen seeking shield. Oh, wait. She doesn't have one. She doesn't have one. Um, we're actually getting quite a bit of dark elixir here. I think that should get us at least one of our discounts. So we could... Oh, we're, we're really close on the mortars. Um, but it's realistically like two more, but we do get the builder base. We do get a rune of gold here. So let's see what, what do we have as far as gold upgrades? Oh, uh, they're still 5.5, huh? We don't really have any loot in there. Mm, do we have these? Uh, we do have those. Uh, let's, let's see. I thought I saw that's 6.61, 6.63. Mm hmm. We have enough to upgrade the queen now. Do we have any gold in here? 6.63, huh? We're almost right there for that. Uh, let me just go snipe just a little bit of gold here. And just a smidgen of gold. Or we can get like a bomb tower. We can get like 40 points. Like none of those are like really easy though, huh? I guess let's just go snipe a little bit of gold. All right, so now, oh, we can actually get one of these archer towers upgrading one of the big archer towers. So that'll work out to level 19. And then we can pop off a rune of gold since we just got that. And we can also upgrade a hero. Uh, wait. Oh, did I not grab the rune of gold? Oh, there we go. Now we can pop off the rune of gold and use that. Honestly, like, we could upgrade the queen. But I think I'm going to upgrade the royal champion. She needs a little bit more work. So I think we're going to upgrade the royal champion here. Uh, get her upgrading. And then, since we have that rune of gold popped off, I think we're going to go for two more of these archer towers to get them up to level 19 since we have all this excess gold. So there we go. Town Hall 13 is looking good. Pop over to the 14. Now the Town Hall 14 is actually in a decent little spot here because I did opt to get the gold pass. I was kind of on the fence about it, but I decided to get the gold pass. But now we can go ahead. We can upgrade two archer towers because we did get tons and tons of gold. So we're good there. We can dump all of our elixir into walls because that's really all we have. All of our heroes are done on this account, so things are looking up. 
and even in our pet house here we have enough to upgrade whatever we want here i think we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna elect to max out the electro owl so let's go ahead and let's get that electro owl upgrading here seven day upgrade i will boost off since we have one of those that'll take a full day off but we really don't have a lot left because we have another rune of gold we could pop off here so we can go ahead and we can get two more archer towers down here no big deal yeah so we can work through all of that but we will have like some freeing up here in a couple days and we do have star bonus available so i wouldn't mind getting that while we're here all right since we need gold let's go for gold we're gonna try essentially the same strategy we were using on the last account but the firecrackers added in instead of super wizards uh i kind of think this has some potential here let's uh let's run this all in through here like this i'm kind of going to get things going early just because this is like a little bit of a hot corner over here let's go ahead and get those working in here let's go ahead and wall breaker okay actually we get through that corner pretty decently that actually wasn't I was a little bit concerned about it but now we're fine so the firecrackers are essentially going to act like our super wizards on this attack i don't know seems seems fun to me guys seems like a good time to me Let's go ahead and let's rage up through here. Uh, let's see. Should we pop king ability? Yeah, let's pop king ability here. Try to get through some of these singles. Okay, nice working. Oh, yeah, this is looking real good. This is looking real dandy here, guys. All right, let's go ahead and throw that in there. Normally, we throw RC with the bat, so let's do just that. And, uh, yeah, there's going to be nothing to stop us here. Nothing to stop us, so let's just work through here with our cleanup. Uh, we'll throw the minion in after all the bats are done spawning. And then we can just uh, take all this stuff down. Those firecrackers actually serve pretty well. Like if you're using like uh, the super wizard, or super wizards or super archers, I like the firecrackers work pretty decently. I wouldn't mind using them like in a super archer blimp. Like that would be really cool. But obviously we can't get them in the CC. But that's a nice little bit of dark elixir, or I guess a little bit of everything. Uh, but we also have one more star bonus, so let's uh, get that one done too. All right, this one should do. Now, I did just find a progress base, so I sniped out the town hall in that, so that this should be all we really need here. So that'll be good. We get all of our builders going. We actually did pretty good here today, guys. We did pretty good, and that's what this Let's Play is all about now, is just doing what we can when we can. If we're going to be playing multiple accounts, there's always a ton going on in Clash Clans. Let's just do what we can and try to keep our builders going the best we can. But if I'm a builder or two free, that's okay. It's not the end of the world. We'll get to it next time or we'll just get some other upgrades. Especially like when you get to these higher level town halls. It, it really becomes a chore getting all this stuff like consistently going when you're trying to do what I am and play way too many accounts. Yeah, it is what it is, guys. I, I like playing lots of accounts. I like just playing all different town hall levels. Just kind of keeping me fresh on all the different town hall levels. I don't know. It's just kind of what I enjoy in Clash of Clans. And that's the beauty of the game. Everyone can play the way they want to play. It's, it's, it's a beautiful thing. You play how you want to play. I'm going to play how I want to play with my 30 million accounts. Okay, not that many. There are people that have way more accounts than me and make me look like I have, like, no accounts. It's kind of ridiculous, to be honest with you. But, again, they play how they want to play. I play how I want to play. You guys play how you want to play. It's all gravy, baby. It's all gravy. Nice. So we get some loot there. We get our second star bonus. We want that for the equipment stuff, the ores. I couldn't, the, the word slipped me. We'll grab all that. Actually, I should have left that in the treasury. But that's where we're going to wrap it up today. Come back tomorrow. I know there's been some requests for the rush account. I have, hopefully I can get it done in time. I'm going to do a uh, 10 builder potion challenge on the rushed account so hopefully you guys did enjoy this video if you did don't forget to leave a like and subscribe you guys have a great day keep on flash bashing